breaking it off right there at the sticks. So many times you see him. Uh, see how good the pack's been on first down. Finley wants some time here. He's going to cut this one loose. Coming back for it is Harmon. Flag down on the play. Kelvin Harmon around the Georgia State 30-yard line. You know, last week watching the game, even against Kennesaw State, Jerome Smith at 5'10", they have him listed at 180, got into a couple situations where he had good coverage and just the big bodies he had a tough time with. That's the exact same thing here. Nice little pickup on first down. It's still not quite in the panic mode, thanks to Harmon. Hard play to get out of bounds. Right across the middle and breaking away, Kelvin Harmon. Inside the 35. Now you got to hurry it up. Good yep. play by Harmon. Four-yard throw. Stone saved the touchdown. Good protection up front again by the big guys. He's the guy that Dave Dorn pointed out to watch out for on all the special teams. Finley, straight drop, little flip down the field for Harmon, who makes a great catch at the 22 with Jalen Jones all over him. Eighth catch of the day for Kelvin Harmon. And he's shaking up here. Again, all the time that Finley needs. Just puts it out there for those, those crossers. They're, they're coming across that field on those different levels. Get the wind knocked out of him here? Hard to tell. That's what I would guess. Tom Wormy, Dave Archer, Larisha Harris on the sidelines. Finley with a quick drop and throw beyond the 40. Kelvin Harmon, very capable hands, has the catch. It's a first down. There is a Virginia player shaken up on the play. This is going to be another collision. Excellent read by Finley to get the ball out, and then it comes in. Effort across the states of North and South Carolina. Finley with all day back there. Has to get out of the pocket. Throwing on the run is Finley, and it is... Caught along the sideline, Kelvin Harmon. Dave, that's some freelancing by Finley. Virginia only comes with a three-man pass rush. See, only three are rushing, so eight are in coverage. But if you give a quarterback this long to, to free up, and what happens is Kelvin Harmon finds a hole in that eight. Four for four in the red zone today for NC State. Three TDs and a field goal. Towards the end zone. Front corner. Adjusting to the ball and a touchdown. Kelvin Harmon for the Wolf Pack. 16 yards from Ryan Finley for the score. The ball is put by Finley. DB's in good position. That is the epitome of a back shoulder fade throw by Finley. It's Terry Angeline, the tight end, in that slot to the left side for second down. Here's another throw. What a catch! Harmon came back to make the play, and that was against Hamp Cheevers, James. This is the matchup they want. And Harmon on Hamp Cheevers. Look at Cheevers. He's got good coverage. He's there. But you know what? Harmon is more physical. They'll get the ball to start the second half, too. Ryan taking the shot. Harmon. Did he get a foot down? Sure he did. Boy, Kelvin Harmon is a show now. Good job. Protection. Plenty of time for Finley. And there's that back shoulder throw. We've seen it to Meyer a couple times in this one, and that one's a BC has to get off the field here. They've got to get a stop. Finley looks. Harmon again a catch. And that's Jones in coverage that time as well. And that time Finley to Harmon converts it. Or until they move somebody out there to help, and then you just hit him with the one-two, and you let you let the backs run free. I mean, with the route, but you've got the big old body walling you off. An easy throw and catch. Lobbing for Harmon. Caught it. Touchdown. Again, plenty of time. Nobody for Bo to even block. And then one on one, it's Lucas Dennis. A little bit of help late over the top. Swings it out quickly to Kelvin Harmon. Across the 20, and that's all Trayvon Moen to stop Holly Rowe. Trying to avoid a second straight loss. Syracuse has been bringing heat all night, and the pass complete out across the 30-yard line to Kelvin Harmon. You know, you can tell there's a lot of great camaraderie between the player and coach. Couple of fakes in the backfield. A deep ball and wide open on the run. And the catch made at the 20, Kelvin Harmon. Touchdown, NC State. Off of the penalty, 74 yards. 
game. But again, protection is great. A little bit of action in the back. And nobody's home. I mean, the distance between him and Bradshaw was about five. Right now in the driver's seat in the Big 12 with their win earlier this year over Oklahoma. Wow. On the run, the catch is made down inside the 35 and hauled down at the 30-yard line. With the pull jersey to find that football and hold it. In down passes in that first half of 67 and 74 yards. Slings it out across the 30, and Kelvin Harmon continues to have a monster night. Heat coming up the middle. Finley downfield, and it's hauled in at the 20, and down inside the 10, Kelvin Harmon. All game today, There's both of them are 6'3", Beth, but Harmon has just taken over every time they get it to him, and that, that was a taking a risk on that throw there on third and short. Finley to the end zone, the back shoulder throw to Harmon, touchdown. It's too easy, Beth. To stop him, and I'll tell you now, he, he's catching balls, touchdowns, and, and yards at a tour pace right now. He's got plenty of time, and he's looking for Harmon. Kelvin Harmon, the catch maker, down to the Florida State 41. Guy who is the best receiver on that team, and he is certainly a first round pick candidate. Now looking for Harmon. You bet. Touchdown. talked about this matchup all day. Finley to Harmon and just no chance. Finley from that pistol formation swings it out left side. Harmon tries to get a block and he will get stopped short. By a thousand paper cuts just taking what the defense gives you not getting bored. You're seeing you're playing like it. Some of the leaders on this defense have had to step up and play and has to do a little bit more than the normal guy. That completion short by plenty to Harmon of uh, the first down. It'll be third down. The 25. First and 10 for NC State. Finley to his right. Has a step for his receiver to the end zone. And it's a touchdown to Kelvin Harmon. One matchup. A little double move by Harmon. Slant and go. And Harmon gets on top the ball, a little bit underthrown, but we show you. Go to the ACC title game is the fact that Wake playing to put themselves in a bowl game, coming off a big win against NC State a week ago. They'd be bowl eligible for the third straight year for the Demon Deeks and Dave Clawson as we check in with Marisha. The day for Reggie Gillespie had been shut out the last two games. He's got three TDs in this one and two rushing. This is Harmon creating space inside the five. Kelvin Harmon, the ambassador of the corner. Excellent throw right over the top till we talked about Harmon's ability to go get the football when it never getting rhythm offensively Seventh time this season that Finley has thrown for 300 or more yards his backup McKay on the run to the 25 And the catch made Kelvin Harmon the ball over a Louisville defender here Harmon gonna stay alive with his quarterback He's gonna get that left foot down if they give you the look if they don't then you get out of it Finley from a secure pocket into double coverage down to the five. Kelvin Harmon has his first grab of the game. Well, best throw of the day by Finley. Excellent job to win to the outside versus press. Continue to get a little bit better, a little bit brighter. Finley steps up and throws inside the 35 yard line to Kelvin Harmon, who beat Patrice Renee. Harmon. Watch him push, make it look like go. Renee gets out of there, starts running, and then he breaks down. And On third and 11, Finley, Harmon, touchdown! Bro, only one person can get this front, this route, and that's going to be Harmon. And he reaches out, beats the defender. Finley, we've said it all afternoon, plenty of time. His receivers open a lot of time. That pass is amazing. Get low, away from the defense. Look at this, steps up in the pocket. That's a cost of numbers. That's a 30-yard pass.